Hello, brothers and sisters. I wanted to make a video uh, concerning this robot named Sophia that they have created, that Hanson's Robotics has created. Um, this robot was given. This robot was given citizenship in Saudi Arabia, and. I know a lot of people, they're thinking this is a cool idea. They're like, oh, yeah, it's awesome that we have a robot out here, that they're upping technology and, you know, introducing all these different avenues of technology. And honestly, people, for those who don't have the eyes to see and you can't really see what the problem is with this, you won't really be able to see that we're really coming towards the end. And for you not to see what they're doing with this really bothers me. It really bothers me. People are so caught up in technology nowadays that they just want to get lazy. They want to depend on technology. And they want to say, oh, well, we need this advancement. The people that are, first of all, in charge of this technology, most of them don't even believe in God. Someone asked one the uh, this man from Hanson's Robotics, "Does the robot will the robot be able to have consciousness?" And he said, "Well, I don't really know what consciousness is, and that's a really hard subject to deal with. But I do believe that we will have." consciousness integrated with the the robots now that's the problem here's the problem here these people don't even know what consciousness is they don't even believe in the spirit most of the time they don't even believe in our heavenly father they don't believe in our lord jesus christ they don't believe in heaven they don't even know where they're going with this the word of God tells us that the knowledge of men is foolishness, foolishness. It tells us that for a reason. And you got a lot of people out here following these scientists saying, oh, yeah, they're doing a great job. I'm going to follow them all the way, going all the way to the end with them with this technology. The word of God tells us that knowledge in the last days shall be increased. It shall be increased. And more will be revealed to us. And I just want to say, people, if you're one of those people who are caught up in technology and you think this is something we need, then you're one of those people who potentially may be lukewarm if you're a Christian. And a person whose eyes have not been opened yet. And you are of the world. Jesus told us, be in the world, but not of it. I'm going to end this video. But this is a warning to my fellow brothers and sisters. And those people who do not follow Christ. This is a warning. If you are a fellow Christian... And you're fine with this technology. That's a problem. The word of God tells us that the image of the beast, the image was given the ability to speak. They called this robot the other day, maybe even a week ago. They called this robot an image. It says the word of God tells us the image was given the ability to speak. And those who did not worship the image, those who do not worship this image shall be put to death. That is what the word of God tells us will happen. And here's the problem with this also. They have a church. They have now made it a religion for artificial intelligence. And now they, they're trying to get a church going for artificial intelligence, which the Godhead in which they have to create a Godhead. Now, Godhead is going to be man. The man who created it. 
what kind of if y'all don't see the problem with this your eyes have not been open <laughs> we're in the end of times people it's about time it's about time people it's about time Jesus is coming soon and if your eyes aren't open yet you just might be staying here Open your eyes. And if you can't open your eyes, because you are a fool, ask the Lord to open your eyes for you. I love you, and Jesus loves you. Keep your eyes open. Open your mind. Pay attention, and look. Bye-bye.